Hello, you guys, my beautiful, handsome people. I'm sending you guys peace, love, light, and protection from my team to yours. Kisses, kisses, kisses. Let's get straight into the message. I just want to get straight into the message for some reason. Let me give one more good shuffle. Please take what resonates with you. Let's see what's going on for you guys. What's the energy here? We have alliance, trust, community, compatibility. Mm. With collaboration at the bottom of the deck here. So you may have a um somebody don't want to group up with you. Don't want to gain your trust here. Look at that. We got indulgence. Yeah. Somebody want to gain your trust, but this person is wearing a mask. There's a false person here trying to gain your trust. That's a part of a group of people. Laughing in your face, but talking behind your back. We got good news. Hmm. Not too sure what that is. We got Fury, Mad, right up under Alliance. Somebody's mad because they can't get you to trust them. <laughs> it's hard for somebody to get close to you, and they're mad about that. Endorsement. <coughs> With apology at the bottom of the deck. Somebody was paid to come close to you, to befriend you, to get in a relationship with you. Somebody was paid to get close to you. Now this person wants to apologize for something. They didn't listen. Listen to their better judgment when it came to you. We got disturbance. <coughs> mm. I don't know why I'm coughing like that. Someone here has a dark attachment on them. You, you receiving good news literally irritates somebody so much to the point they had to team up with another person or group of people here to stall you. We got evidence at the bottom of the deck. Some type of evidence is possibly getting ready to come out about the situation. I'm going to leave it right here. That might be significant. Let's clarify this, though. Let's clarify what's going on in this situation. Yeah, I find like somebody is mad because they can't get close to you. Well, this person can't get close to you no more. This could be someone you used to trust at one point in time, but then you started recognizing their sneaky behavior, and you cut ties, or you slowly started to shift away from it. Mm. Or you slowly started to shift away from them. Oh, I feel like I'm getting sick of some child. We got the queen. This queen of wands been coming out a lot lately. She been coming out a lot lately. Let's see what's going on here for you guys. Clarify this um alliance. We got the king of cups. Let me move the cards down a little bit more so you guys can see. Hmm. What's the King of Cups with the four wands at the bottom of the deck? What's the King of Cups? Oh, child, we got the King and the Queen of Cups. What's the King, Queen of Cups? Oh, my goodness. With the Page of Cups. Ooh. This could be a lover. Yeah, this could definitely be a lover. Upset because they can't get close to you. This could even be a sibling. Like, this could be like a brother-sister dynamic. Auntie, mom. Like, you know, that type of thing. Or this is just love. This is somebody you used to trust. Someone close to you. Both of you could be water signs here. This could be your baby father here as well, though. And this page of cups could be like talking about like a kid. 
King, Queen of Cups, and then the Kid, Page of Cups. Yeah, like, I, I don't know. I gotta get some more on this. Because, child, what is this? I don't know what this is. I gotta get some more, though. What's the uh, King of Cups? What's the King of Cups? Okay, so we got Triumph, Trophy, the Energy of Success, Victory. What's the Queen of Cups? What's the Queen of Cups? We got Libation, it fell right on top of Mad with Merit Making. And Aid at the bottom of the deck. This Queen of Cups could be trying to get close to this King of Cups. That's a it's like a it's a feminine energy here trying to get close to a masculine energy, I feel. Like someone's praying to have a better connection with a person. Whoever this Queen of Cups is, what's the Page of Cups? Family. This is a kid. This is a family, yo. This is a, this is a baby father situation. Again, this could be you and this Page of Cups energy, and this could be talking about your parents. You not being closer to your parents no more, or this is literally a relationship here. Some type of relationship dynamic. Let me get one more from this deck, cause the fact that this came that this came out like that, and the fact that my uh nail just came off. One well, of my press songs just came out, child. Press, 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 press. I feel, I do feel a press energy here though. Two of Swords. What's the King Queen of Cups? Let's see. What's the king, queen of cups? Child, the king cups came out again. They're like, it's me, baby. What you mean? What's the king, queen of cups? <laughs> okay, so why is the king of cups out here twice? So there's def this is a water sign. Three of cups in reverse. And we got this, this indulgence right here. Yo, let me find out. Let me find out. There's a demon choir right here at the top of the deck. Let me find out. Why this three of cups in reverse, though? Page of Wands. Freeing themselves from a group of people here. Who they used to trust at one point in time. Why the king of cups out here twice? We got strength. Someone's trying to stand in their power and stand on their own two feet here. If this this uh if this is like a third party situation, like someone you used to deal with, someone is in a uh, connection with another person that they don't want to be with no more. Or if this is someone here like that was like paid to come close. To, mm, mm. What's this three of reverse? Something fishy going on here. We got the five of wands. Something fishy going on here with a group of people. Something fishy. Or someone just talked to too many people. Either way, it's like, <clears throat> I don't like the energy. Look, as soon as I pick up the deck, collaboration. I'm telling you, something's going on with the good people here, bro. What's this other King of Cups? Apology. With eternal love. Somebody want to come towards you. This King of Cups energy wants to come towards you. This King of Cups energy sees a family with you. Somebody is praying that you accept their apology here. With eternal love, someone has, wants, wants to gain your trust. And they feel like they're, and they're mad because they feel like it's so hard to gain your trust because you're so standoffish. You're not letting somebody get close to you. This person could have put you in a third-party situation here. Mm -mm. They did something here. Wanted to apologize to you and shit. What you do? That's what I want to know. What you do? Why you sorry? He came out here twice. So this is definitely a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They could have definitely like put you in third-party situations. Clarify this uh, indulgence here. 
this friend card. We got the high priestess. What's the high priestess? Yeah, everything is fine. Ten of Swords. Six of Wands at the bottom. Hmm. I feel like you ain't got time to... I feel like you're too busy worried about your success here. I see the lover showing his face. I feel like you're too busy worried about your success and co-creating with the universe, with God right now. And your focus, you focus on something here with this high priestess. I feel like people just want to play mind games with you. You're not key keen with people right now. You're healing. Something about your mindset that you're healing. And I feel like people just want to come back into your life and just restart old cycles with you. And I really feel like it's to block you from your success. These people see you standing in your power here with this screen card. Whoever this King of Cups is who see you as a match Queen of Cups, there's a King of Cups here who see you as the Queen of Cups. And that's for some of you because for some of you, this is definitely somebody that's uh, in a marriage with another person. They got a whole family situation going on here. But this person don't want to be with that person. They want to be with you. Someone here pretends like they're they a queen of cups, but they're really not. They, they're a queen of cups in reverse, but you're a queen of cups upright. What's this high priestess where everything is fine? I just feel like you're healing. Two of swords with the queen of pentacles. You're, you're, block, you're blocking out everything that's um trying to cause illusions for you with the seven of cups from getting to your money, your pentacles. From becoming more stable with yourself. You want some stuff. You, you, you care about your stuff. All you care about is your stability right now. You don't care about any nonsense. Anything that's going to like put you in this ten of swords energy. With the seven of cups and eight of pentacles. Like no. I feel like you just focus on your, uh, your, your money right now. Your family if you have one. If you already got kids. Wife or husband. You just focus on. You and your wife, husband, and kids. And what y'all going together. Or if it's just you, you just focus on your business here. You might be dating every now and then, but you're not looking for nothing too serious. You know? And people are like meeting up together behind the scenes. And they're discussing these changes that you're making right now. Especially when it comes to your mind here with that high priestess. What's the high priestess? Let the page of swords reverse. I feel like one point in time you was very immature. You didn't really, yeah, at one point in time, like, you would, like, kick it with people and gossip with them, possibly, you know, indulge in low vibrational energy. And it's not that you think you're too good to be doing whatever right now. It's just, you just, you making some changes. You, you're investing into yourself, especially your low vibrational energy is here with this devil. And the nine of swords, you happen to you looking in the mirror. You at a point in your life right now where you're looking in the mirror. And it's putting you on a path that's for you. Yeah, you was definitely childish at one point in time with that page of swords reverse. <laughs> What's the page of swords reverse? With the eight of pentacles. But now you're working on your ten of pentacles. Literally. You did the work to come out this page of swords reverse energy. And you're protecting it. You're protecting yourself right now. I don't blame you. Protect yourself. Well, what's this five of wands? That's who this five of wands is, child. Hesitation. Choose between you and a whole bunch of other people. If this is the uh, masculine here who uh, wanted to come towards you, this person got a whole bunch of women. And they, they, they couldn't choose between one. They used to juggling people. They used to having more than one. They don't want they don't want one person. They ain't used to it. We got a nightmare with loss. And now they beat themselves up about it. Mad. If they didn't expect for you to move on, they expected for you to join join along join along with the crowd and be texting them, asking them where they at, you know, clinging on to their energy, letting them distract you. 
playing games, worrying, crying, being in anxiety, like all that stuff that people ain't got time for, basically. You ain't got time for none of that. Clarify everything is fine. I see the seven of pentacles again. A lot of pentacles out here. You could definitely be an earth sign. We got the ace of cups with the eight of swords. Did I not say that you was protecting yourself? That you are investing? This eight of swords is like you self-sabotaging yourself. I kind of said that in my last reading too. So you could be drawn to watch my last reading. It could be a message in there for you as well. But this is like self-love. This is someone showing love to themselves. That's what I'm getting. It's like, even during the moments when you were in your head, you were still trying to think about ways here to care for yourself and how to come out this energy. You was investing. And the one thing didn't work, you went back to the drawing board to find out something else that would work. You did the steps here. Clarify this Ace of Cups with the Eight of Swords and everything is fine. Like, you, you kept telling yourself everything is going to be okay. I'm, I'm going to get out of this. We got illness here. I'm going to get out of this. And you've been fighting this battle since you were a kid. You could have definitely, like, went through a lot of things here on your own. And during your weakest moments. I feel like during your weakest moments, like... I feel like you just had God right there by your side. Even during your weakest moments. Even as a kid. God been by your side helping you fight. That's what I'm seeing with this illness here. Clarify this illness specifically. Because I'm getting something with this card. Specifically. <laughs> Look at that. Ready. Helping you fight. Helping you get back up. And fight the good fight. <laughs> Seriously. You could be saying 444 at this time. Or three 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 five 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 three four five. Because we got 34 of this commitment at the bottom of the deck. And 44 on this readiness. And 35 on this illness. You the illness. You ill. You the illness. You have a good heart here too. I thought you got a real good heart here. Someone has a real good heart. And I love it. Don't close your heart off to nobody or anything. Just know how to separate your energy to get back to who you truly are. But yeah, we're going to keep going. Let's get back into it. Clarify this good news. You got some type of good news coming in because you ended some type of cycle here with the world. <laughs> the card just came out so effortlessly. <laughs> well, the good news is you get to start a brand new cycle. Page of Pentacles, a brand new cycle. Someone's about to get ready to get a, a seed here. Some type of opportunity is getting ready to come in for you. What's the world? I'm going to just clarify the world. Look at that three of cups showing his face. It didn't come out, but it definitely showed his face. Eight of swords. Eight of swords. And then the three of cups showed his face. This three of cups, eight of swords almost came out together. This is a group of people here, bro. I'm telling you. They want you to self-sabotage. This is the goal, to attack your mind, to attack how you feel about yourself, how you think about yourself. They don't want you thinking about ways to elevate and grow. They attack, they, they send you mental magic. These people are doing mental magic towards you, whether they realize they're doing this or not. If you sit around gossiping about people, wishing bad on their downfall, you are doing magic. You are performing witchcraft, and it's going to come back to bite you in the patootie, okay? Just so we're clear. Just so we clear, babe, because that almost came out together. But again, the world with the Eight of Swords, this cycle of you being in this Eight of Swords energy is over with. And I was just speaking about the Eight of Swords energy with this illness. I mean, even when you were in this Eight of Swords energy, you were still ill because you were still trying. Yeah, you definitely got something within you that people like that they can't stand. Something about your energy. What's the Eight of Swords with the world? With the four of swords. That's something about you easily being able to heal. Easy being able to see the light at the end of the tunnel. With the six of wands and get back up. And keep going. You could definitely be a Leo here. You don't have to be. 
That's some good energy. The sun with the six of wands and the empress with the temperance. That's beautiful energy. You go. I feel like you go through a lot of things here, and a lot of a lot of what you go through is nothing but tests. Nothing but tests. But this never ending cycle of self sabotaging yourself, and especially being around people who project their energy onto you without you knowing. But now you peep game. This is over with. There's a new, a new, a new pinnacle coming in for you. Some type of new opportunity. What's this page of pinnacles? I just seen the three of cups, and they watching. They know you got good news coming in with the chariot, and it's gonna put you in boss status. What's the page of pinnacles with the chariot? It's gonna put you right at boss status with the moon, and they got them feeling some type of way. They feeling some type of way with the four of wands, cause you getting ready to celebrate some type of achievement here. It's coming. What's the world? It's coming. Look at that stress. This never-ending cycle of you being in this eight of swords energy, my dear, is over with. Did I not just say that? I was just speaking about this, and this is what this is. Stress. Babe, these days are over with. It's like you're at the point of your life right now. If you're going through this eight of swords energy, it's because of something that you are deliberately doing to yourself. It's something that you need to go, but I, but again, like I ain't trying to project that onto you guys because I feel like you know better now. I feel like you've been through that. I've done that. I've been there. I've done that. You know, I've been through this. I've learned that lesson. I know not to do this no more. I know I don't want to go through this. I know what hurts me. I know what makes me sad. I know what ticks me. You know, I know what hurts my nerve. I know what makes me happy. You know more about yourself right now. This stress energy is came to an end. This this cycle is over with. The cycle is over with. I mean, of course you might you may get some. Of course, you know we still live in the real world here, but yeah. But the with trap at the bottom of the deck, I meant to show that. But as far as you just being trapped in this cycle, of not knowing which way to go, that's over with because you've learned a lot through people and situations. So this so this is the good news here. The good news is you have a new opportunity coming in and a stressful, never ending cycle of mainly people projecting this eight of swords energy onto you is over with. Okay, what's this um what's the uh, page of pentacles? Oh, we got care. They just fail. I don't know. A new a new project. Some of you are getting ready to get pregnant with either a baby or a new project. Again, that page of pentacles. So this pentacles is coming in the form of a family. So you're gonna meet a man here, someone that's gonna wanna court you, that may be hiding themselves right now with the moon card being out here, or you're gonna get um some type of new project idea. And this is what they've been doing magic to. With this uh, ritual at the bottom of the deck. They've been doing magic to sacrifice something that you got coming in. The blind. This is the blind leading the blind, child. Just the blind leading the blind. That's basically what I just got from that. <laughs> Seriously. All right. Clarify this uh, fury. Got the three of swords. Mm-hmm. That's just three of swords. You got the Queen of Wands. Who this Queen of Wands specifically? You could be this fire sign, or this could be uh someone else. Hoss watcher or something. Oh, we got the Queen of Wands with the Empress. I thought this is you. This is that this some project here. This is you and your uh creative energy. This is you creating. You could definitely be saying three, three, three. This is you creating. What's this three of swords? With the four of cups. And the page of cups at the bottom of the deck. What's the queen of wands? Oh, is that the double? Hold on, y'all. 
Yep, that was a double. Queen of Wands is a double. Yeah, this is definitely you with the Ace of Wands. Baby, you a hard worker here. You are a hard worker. People are so mad. You got people so upset with themselves. They did not partner up with you. They did not get close to you. And they misjudged you. They read you too wrong. They, 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 they threw you to the woods, baby. You just want nothing to these people. And this is, a, this is a multitude of different stories here I'm getting. It's different stories here that I'm getting. That you are you are literally drop to gorgeous. Literally. And you are really a hard worker. You're definitely seen as someone that's a hard worker. And you have a hold of your vices here. It's like you have a lot of self-control with this Queen of Wands devil. What's the Queen of Wands with the devil? I feel like you have a lot of self-control here. That's the star, babe. Look at that, the star. You have a lot of self-control. Drop dead gorgeous like I just said. You a hard worker, and it's going to put you right in star status if you're not seen as a star already. Remember the Eight of Pentacles came? We got the Eight of Pentacles with the star right on top of each other. Because we got this spirit and alliance right under each other. Yeah. You did the work to come out of some type of cycle here. Baby, somebody is focused. What's this Queen of Wands with the double and the star? No, oh, yeah, baby. Get that work done. We got introvert. Yeah. You in hermit mode right now. And uh, you're a natural born introvert. You love your privacy. You know, you might look good or whatever. And a lot of people are watching you online. A lot of people are watching you in this star status. You could be a reader here. You could be saying 666 or 222. 2222. Two, 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 two. <laughs> yeah, that's some people watching you. Mmm, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. You got some people, you got people tight, bro. You got some people tight. Like, it's okay. It's okay, little Tintin. -tin. You'll be okay. It's, o it's okay. What's the double specifically? It's okay. <laughs> These people are so mad that you get this, that, that, that there's evidence that you have proof of your hard work. That people can see how hard you work on yourself. There's proof. You may have projects and things that you might have started. Maybe you didn't finish it, but you try. You're trying. People see that you are making progress towards bettering yourself, becoming a better version of yourself. And it ain't based on them wanting you to be a version of your, a better version of yourself. It's because you're ready to be a better version of yourself. You are in alignment with your life, and you're not trying to fast pace your life just to please somebody else and to walk the journey for them. You're walking the journey for you. Just because it's their moment don't mean it's meant to be your moment, and you're okay with that. You see, some people get to their moment, and other people are not at their moment, and they want to brag about being at their moment. But you better be doing all you can while you're at your moment. And stacking your stacking your cheese and your bread the way you're supposed to be while you're at your moment. Because you're trying to shit on somebody else and that's not at their moment. Not realizing that all T's and I's are being crossed and dotted here. So when this person gets to their moment, oh baby, they going all the way in. You are going all the way the f in and you are doing a heck of a good job and I'm so proud of you keep going no matter where you are on your journey right now you are on the right path don't let nobody tell you or make you think that you need to overdo something or go work a little faster on something walk with your own guidance listen to yourself clarify the star specifically listen to yourself think that we got conflict <laughs> It did come out of reverse, and we got luck. <laughs> I feel like people want to settle their differences with you. Some people here want to settle their differences with you because they see you in the spotlight now, and they see if they can get something out. They think they can get something out of you with this luck. Oh yeah, we didn't hit the jackpot this time. Oh, they didn't came up off some money, baby. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, I don't know might not talk to us now, right, or whatever. But we gonna sweet talk all the way back in. We just give them a little minute. You know, talk to them every now and then. 
check on a kid. Maybe if they got a kid, we're going to get, get there. It might take a little time. Or, no, they just, ooh, ooh. They just know they're going to get back in, huh? They just know they're going to get back in your good graces and try to get some of your pie. Ooh, they just know, right, Collector? Hmm, here he, he is. Stay far, far away, baby. Bad, back, bad, back. Give me 50 feet. I would say 10, but your breath is killing me. <laughs> That's what I just heard. <laughs> All right, clarify this. Um, What deck was I using first? This one. Clarify this endorsement, this bribery, paying people to do shit and stuff, right up under this Three of Cups energy. Five of Pentacles. With the Dove card. And then I see the tennis. Somebody could have paid somebody to end you? What? Wait, wait, hold on. Let me let me go back and look at what's on this three of uh, this energy right here. What came out for this? What came out for that five of wands? I clarified this five of wands. Hmm. But this is like death magic. This could be death magic to send you endings and stuff. Yeah, this is death magic to play with your mind with the high priestess. Somebody went to a high priestess to end someone. Somebody went to a high priestess to try to end a high priestess, literally. Give me one more for this um endorsement. One more for this. And you on guard against everything and everybody right now. And it is very much felt. We got the page of wands. You on guard. You on guard, baby. People feel it. What's this five of pentacles? You ain't playing no games right now when it comes to your energy. With the star, baby, we got the star here twice. Right next to each other at that. Right next to each other. These people want to see you have an ending so bad. With the judgment at the bottom and the magician. Somebody was definitely doing some type of magic here. But it's okay. What's the star here with the Five of Pentacles? Seven of Pentacles. Something could have possibly not worked. They went back to the drawing board, tried to come up with a new idea to do something. What's this page of wands? The Magician. What's the page of wands with the Magician? This could have been happening since you was a teenager with the Knight of Cups. Somebody could have been getting readings on you for a while here to see what's coming into your life here. Somebody could have been getting readings on you without you even knowing that, that they was getting readings. What's the star? Relaxation, peace. You at peace. You in star status right now. What's the magician? You live and you learn. You live and you learn. Somebody about to learn a tough lesson about this magic. What's the magician here with this you live and learn? Let me get one more. Somebody about to learn a tough lesson with vow and death at the bottom of the deck. I feel like it is about to hit them. Somebody was worshiping some type of dark entity here, and now it's attached to them. Somebody wanted wanted something to attach to you, and they was expecting to receive some good news about this being successful. And that's why they're right under each other. But somebody here is stressed out because this is not what's happening right now. Whatever they try to do to you is backfiring on them. That's exactly what I'm getting here. Clarify this uh, disturbance. Yeah, somebody was working with some type of entity here or something. We got the four of wands. Give me one more. And somebody household doing magic. Yeah, with the entity, with the double. I'm telling you. What's this four of wands? With the five of swords. The now, this whole group is dismantling with each other right now. They splitting ways. They splitting apart. I'm saying arguments going on about st stuff that's working, what's not working, 
Why are you still successful? Why are you still happy? Why it don't seem like you need to be in a mental hospital or something? Why you not all over the place? You, this entity is supposed to be on, attached to you. We got a disturbance out here with the devil that just clarified it. This entity is supposed to be attached to you. But they about to find out real quick who is really about to be attached to. What's the devil? I'm telling you. They came out quick. Ace of Cups. Hmm. It's like God telling them since you love the devil so much, since you love being being a devil so much, since you love doing so much wrong. Ooh, we child, I don't know. Since, or since you love doing, I don't know, child. What's it's like? It's like this demon card is speaking to them. I feel like this demon, like God is saying, is speaking to them right now. It's like I was kind of getting a message from God, but this ain't no message from God. This is this, this is something from this demon. What's the devil here with the Ace of Cups? Child with the death card. Since you love doing death magic, demon magic, someone, ooh, we, somebody could have went literally went to like a grave site here. Hmm. This is some dark, this is something very dark here. It's very dark. And with the Ace of Cups being here too, oh my goodness, like somebody poured they all into this. They really did. They poured they all into this. What's the double card? With the Queen of Wands. It was this Queen of Wands doing this to you, Empress. It was a fire sign out here doing magic on you. Oh, no. The child, the fucking Queen of Wands and double came out twice, didn't it? Yeah. The Queen of Wands and the double came out twice. Because the Queen of Wands and the Empress with the Devil came out over here with the star. Oh my goodness, now this is you. Are you protected by a demon here or something? What's the Queen of Wands with the Devil? Or you have control over your lower vibrations. We got the King of Pentacles. What's the Ace of Cups? I'm going to have to get something from the other deck. We got the King of Wands. What's the devil card here? Or again, if this is a masculine here, we got the temperance. If this is a masculine here, you are definitely protected by your angels here. With this temperance card, that's an angel. Archangel Michael, Raphael, Ariel. That's somebody's angel here. The ancestors protecting them. So we got the King and Queen of Wands out here now that I'm just not realizing. The King and Queen of Wands are right here. Hmm, that's interesting. What's this Queen of Wands? With the death card at the bottom of the deck here. If this is a masculine, like you don't give two hex about this masculine no more. We got trap. Somebody wants to trap you with confinement at the bottom of the deck. Mm, what's this king of wands? If, this, if you had a masculine sending you some type of death magic or mental magic to have you stuck on them because they pride and ego child with curse at the bottom of the day. Somebody was doing love magic on you and this love magic has backfired. Somebody was working. Either somebody have a dark entity attached to them like an incubus or succubus or something that was making them do this or they like maybe with somebody else. And they probably put a curse on them or something for them to like try to put a curse on you or something. Child, it's something deep like that. What's the devil? Somebody ego literally. We got saving. This time won't you save me? Oh my goodness. Somebody feel like they need saving. What's the devil here with this saving? Yeah, that's exactly what I'm getting. I'm trying this devil card sticking out to me real hard here. We got perseverance. Someone is like literally fighting with themselves right now. Someone's fighting with themselves right now over something that they did. That they tried to do to you. This person couldn't take you. They couldn't take your energy here. 
And they probably goofed up with a whole bunch of other women that they mess around with here to do some magic on you. They may know a high priestess here. They goofed up with a high priestess and some other women that they mess with to do some magic on you here. If, if this is a masculine, this person tried to do a love spell or something on you. I got to get a little bit from here, y'all. I got to get some more in this situation. Let's see what this is. Let's dig a little deeper, okay? I'm going to get some from here. And I'm going to clarify these cards that came out on their own. See, this person see you as a king, queen of cups, and the king, queen of wands is out here. This person now see you as a match. Oh, wee, that's bad. What's the king of cups? Because the king of cups came out here twice. King of cups came out twice. We got bumping heads for the king of cups. What's the queen of cups? You bumping heads with this person. This person bumping heads with themselves or somebody else that they talking to. We got sweet talk. Yeah. This person, but you and this person bumping here. This person see you as a king, queen of cups, king, queen of wands to them. And y'all bumping heads with each other. It's because this person did something here. Something was done here. What's this apology for this king of cups? Clarify apology. Psycho child. This person crazy. This is a crazy ex child. Mm -mm. This, this person psycho. Oh, hell no. That's why they got down double energy because this person psycho. This person got something attached to them. Mm -mm. This is not a type of, no, mm -mm, baby. What's the five of wands here? Mm -mm, baby. Look at that reckless sex. Love. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? They got a whole bunch of people that they deal with. And you love, I feel like you love yourself too much to deal with that. And instead of receiving good news that the spell worked and they can have you too. They receiving bad news here on how much you love yourself and how you possibly about to get married to a whole other person. And they say they're trying to do something called a separation for you. This person wants you to come back to them. This person receiving bad news instead of this good news. That's what I'm getting here. That's what I'm getting here. Cars all over the place, child. But I, I, I see where everything get though. What's this high priestess? Massive regrets. Somebody went to a high priestess to do a love spell or something. They did. They did. Mm-hmm. They did. What's the eight of swords? The eight of swords are here twice. A lot of swords energy. We got divine masculine. Wow. Someone is really sick in their head about you. The same work you had to do to get out of situations in your life is the same work that a masculine has to do. They came into your life and tries to, like, play God or something, basically. What's the devil here? We got GPS keeping track of you. Somebody's obsessed with you. What's the queen of wands? Yeah, somebody's obsessed with you here. We got thug child. Somebody's obsessed with you. You might even have to get a restraining order on this person. What's the star? Queen B, you in the spotlight here. I'm telling you, you a boss. You are a boss. You are in this star energy right now, baby. You a boss. <laughs> you are seen as a boss, literally. What's this king of wands? Mary. Oh my goodness. This person want to marry you. This fell right on top of Queen B. This person wants to marry you. This King of Wands is this King of Wands see you as a match to they King Queen of Wands with the King Queen of Cups is out here. It's out here. This person like they they like dang man, what did I do? You fucked up, that's what you did. Give me one more for this King of Wands. You messed up. Secluded. This person could this person could have even been married. Yeah, like I say, this person was with somebody else, but they wanted to be with you. This person was married here and and trying to like have you as like a third party as a child. What's this Queen of Wands right here? I don't know what the heck this is for y'all, baby. You ain't going for a side hustle. You ain't going for it. 
You hustling here. The Queen of Wands is out here twice, bro. Queen of Wands out here twice. You are hustling. You and your creative bag. The Queen of Wands and the Star and the Devil is out here twice. You are in your creative bag. Seriously. This message is not for you if you are not in your creative bag right now. Present day. You are in your creative bag. And somebody sees this. And I feel like this person like see you getting more and more successful here. But this person don't want you to be successful without them. They want to be a part of your success here. I feel like there's a multitude of people here who want to be a part of your success. And you're like, no way, Jose. Mm -mm. I just feel like you ain't dealing with it. You ain't putting up with it. You ain't got time for uh for the nonsense is what I feel. What's this magician, though? What's the magician? Ghosted, off and on, detached. Somebody's trying to manifest you back into their life. Give me one more for this apology here. With this psycho ex feelings. But if you got somebody in their feelings, and this could be a false twin with twin flames being in reverse here and drinking toxic lifestyle right behind. This person is toxic. This is a false twin. This is a catalyst twin here. A false catalyst twin. This person thinks that you're the, uh, you're the twin, but you're not. I don't, I don't feel like you're the twin. What's this divine masculine here with this eight of swords? I don't feel like you're the twin. We got shocking news. Did someone here like think they're divine masculine, but they not? Someone here has received some shocking news that they are not who they think they are. And it's really bruising their ego. With this devil being out here twice. Somebody like, ooh, we baby. Somebody is so irritated by your energy. They could be, somebody should drink and let Coke just came out. Y'all just see me shuffling these cards. And Twin Flame and Reverse is still at the bottom of the deck. Somebody is drinking here to the thought of them not being able to have you in their life here. They can't cope with the idea. They can't. Somebody is in their feelings. They This person going crazy over you, bro. They going crazy. They are. Somebody's going to lock you down. Even if they're in a relationship or married. They don't care. They want to have you too. They don't care. They want to have you too, girl. Guy, whoever he is. Even if they are married. They, don't, they do not care. I got to get some from here too, child. Because this is just... This is a lot. <laughs> Let me get some on this King, Queen of Cups here. Let's see what come out of here. Clarify this King of Cups. Big D. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's the Queen of Cups? You probably put that thing on somebody, child. They ain't fell in love. We got nobody can touch me. Look, look what's on the back. You a star. You, I'm telling you, that, you this Queen, this Queen of Cups and this this uh Queen of Wands, that's who you are. This person see can't nobody touch you. You made somebody crazy here. Clarify apology here for this uh, King of Cups. I'm not going to clarify too many cards. Just the ones that's really sticking out to me. Chosen one. Child, well, I'm sorry at the top of that. Someone here sees that you are chosen. Someone here sees that God has a special assignment over your life. And this person, want, they, they and they feeling this person going crazy over you, bro. Even if it don't seem like it right now to you, this person might not even be calling you or texting you. But, baby, they want to. They want to. Clarify this psycho ex here, specifically. They want to. Okay? Who's this psycho ex here, spirit? Thank you. We got pop your shit. With Libra. Somebody could be a Libra here. Or somebody wants to bounce the scales with you or something. They want to talk to you. They want to pop their shit to you. Somebody could be on some drugs here. Like, I don't know. I, I, just, I was just like, no. No. Mm -mm. Somebody crazy. What's the double here? Somebody crazy. Toxic. Somebody is crazy. This person is crazy. This person is crazy, bro. Over you. Give me one more for this double. This person is crazy over you. That just failed, child. We got the ancestors. Look at that. Who are you at the bottom of the deck? Hold on. 
Ancestors just fell. But I, we got ancestors and husband, though. I don't know which one exactly it fell on. So I'm not really going to take it. But I feel like your ancestors have a message for you. In specific, though. So let me let me see what your ancestors want you to know right quick. What do you want this collector to know right quick? From the ancestors. Memory. They're thinking about you. Clarify this memory. Oh, look at that ten of cups with the lovers. They want to. They want you to know that I love you. We thinking about you. We got you in our heart. You know, to stay true to who you are with the identification card at the bottom of the deck. Remember, to, remember to stand your joy, your peace. Remember to choose you. Put you first at the end of the day. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. What's the lovers with the ten of cups with this memory? Your ancestors let you know I got your back, and can't nobody touch you. Period. They come for you. They gotta come for us. With the Knight of Wands. Maybe your people love you. Okay, so that's a little quick message from ancestors. Okay, period. I guess I ain't got to get no more for that double energy. What's the Queen of Wands? What's the Queen of Wands, though? We got drugs with wife at the top of the child. Drugs came out. This person wants to drug you or something. What's the queen of wands? Does this person like think that you're on drugs? No, nah, this person, we got congratulations. Well, forgive me, please. Somebody wants to congratulate you like with smoking or something. Somebody wants you to get back to some toxic behavior of yours. So they're going to try to like come in, try to celebrate with you. What's the star? Somebody wants to try to come in and celebrate with you. A toxic ex. We got Scorpio. Yeah, you went through a transformation. You could be a Scorpio here in specific. Hmm. What's the King of Wands over here? What's the King of Wands? We do got the King and Queen of Pentacles. Child, just realize we got the King and Queen of Pentacles out here too. We got anger issue. This person got this king of wands here is so freaking irritated here. With Le this person could possibly be a Leo. You could be a Leo. King, Queen of Wands out here. But I just realized we got the King and the Queen of Pentacles out here too. Oh my goodness. What's going on here? What's this King of Pentacles? We got closing out cycles. This King of Pentacles did come out for you, Queen of Wands. I feel like that's you. Hmm. What's the devil? Right here. We got what's next? Hard worker. You always into something, always doing something, always grinding. What's the magician? Something that backfired here, though. We got, why do you keep going? These people want you to stop so bad. They doing magic to stop you. But you keep going. Nothing is working. That's what I'm saying. They're like, they're, I said, I just said it earlier. They're like, like they, they telling the high priestess here or they talking to each other because they the ones doing the magic. Like, why is this not working? Why are they still happy? Why are they still moving forward? Why are they still getting things done? Why are they not coming towards me if this is a love situation? Give me one more for this magician. And this is backfiring too. We got to start with two, two, two. They just would not stop. Could have been between two to six people. They just would not stop with dark worker here. They wouldn't stop. Somebody could even be a sex worker here with sex worker at the top. Like they, they just wouldn't stop. They would not stop. And I feel like you was in alignment with yourself, too. The, this 222 could definitely be significant. You could definitely have a message in my last video here. I see tarot reader here at the bottom of the deck. They could have definitely went to a tarot reader here. But they could have did this to a reader. What's the death card? What's the death card? Begging for help. The marriage on the back and husband. Somebody here was married. Somebody here was married. I'm telling you, somebody here was married. And they this is a, like a couple. 
a couple was doing this to somebody. I feel like a couple was doing this to you. A sick ass couple for some of you. They do this. They play people. Clarify this marriage here for this uh, King of Wands. Clarify this marriage. Spiritual battles. Whoever these folks is, though, they finna go through some type of karma here. I didn't even see this uh, sex edition come out. But let's get ready to close this out, you guys. I'm going to get ready to go and close it out. What's the outcome here? What's the outcome? Let's see. We got gold and blessings. You hit your mark. You hit the target. Blessings on the way for you. Clarify this gold. You got blessings on the way for you. I don't know what they got going on. We got the tower. Because you went through a transformation here. What's the tower? With the ten of wands. We got the identification card, the two of pentacles with the uh the strength card. What goes around comes back around, the infinity symbol. I feel like you you taking all these burdens that people try to send your way and you send it right back to them. <laughs> I feel like you're sending people right back the burdens that they tried to send your way. I really do. Clarify this goal. Like they don't belong to me. Take it back. That's why nothing is working that they're doing. And they're gang stalking you. Look at that. I despise you. Alchemist, I'm telling you, whatever they sent your way, you sent it right back to them. And they despise you for this. They despise you for knowing how to get around this. Because whatever they're doing, it can't touch you. It's not touching you. It's not. Give me one more. It's not touching you. You on a motherfucking ball right now, baby. You don't need their validation. I want you to have their validation so bad to, you know, even... Think that you could take off in life? No, you don't need their validation. These people need joy validation. They, ugh, child, let me get out these folks' energy. Let me get out these folks' energy, child, because mm, mm, this is a lot, y'all. Like I said, whoever this is for you, whether it's a sibling or a, a lover here, heavy on the lover energy, though, and they little groupies or whatever, your wife, whoever they did this stuff with, it, mm, this ain't working. It ain't working, bud. I don't know why, but I'm kind of being compelled to pull from here a little bit. It ain't working, bud. What's, what what want to come out of here? What you got for me? Let's see. What you got for me in this situation for the collective so I can close it out, spirit? They don't want to appear as messy as they are. Somebody was very messy in this situation. They try to transfer your good energy to them and have you depleting. What's going on here, Spirit? Let me get one, please. Thank you so much. What's the important message here? Karmic mother. Let me get one card, Spirit. What you got to say? Okay. Didn't want to appear as messy as they are. Somebody here is a messy as man it could be scorpio 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 showing his face twice here somebody could be a scorpio here somebody's messy they don't want you to feel free but you believe in yourself you believe in the impossible you have a, like a very imaginary mind here that somebody could not stop and they actually thought they was gonna be able to stop you and block you they actually thought that didn't they they actually freaking thought they did. All right. Let me end it out with an oracle here for you guys. Let's end it out with an oracle. I haven't read from here in a while. What's the oracle message in this situation? Yang almost came out with, to be fair. Mm-hmm. Somebody want to bounce scales with you now. A masculine energy want to bounce scales with you now. Child, I'm about to mix all my cards up. Oh, somebody wants to confuse you, bro. Like, <laughs> whoever this masculine is. 
All right, let's let's go ahead and pull the oracle. Let's go and get an oracle here, spirit. Thank you. We got peace. You are at peace and community here at the bottom of the deck. You at peace here, babe. I'm gonna read peace for you though. I'm gonna read that. You could be 23 or 23 could be significant. Two, 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 or three, three, three. And we do got two, two, two out here. All right. Twenty-three. Freedom from attachment, radical acceptance. So you're detaching yourself. It doesn't get any better than this. A quiet mind, a heart fulfilled, freedom from want and the soul satisfaction. The way to peace is through radical acceptance. Everything in your word is exactly as it should be. Harmony is beautiful. Enjoy it. What came out with your uh with your ancestors? When I said when I clarified what your ancestors had to tell you, what came out? The Ten of Cups with the lovers. Peace, acceptance, joy, happiness, freedom, love. Oh my goodness. Peace. Peace. You are at peace with who you are and where you are on your journey here. You are at peace. Clarify this peace card. I don't even know why I'm clarifying this, child. I guess I just wanted to pull one more card for you. <laughs> Clarify this peace. Don't let nobody interrupt your peace. I feel like you ain't let nobody interrupt your peace here because you building, baby. And you building to become rich, wealthy. Okay? You building. You ain't let nobody come in and interrupt your peace. And the ones you already kicked off and trying to interrupt your peace, they feeling very ashamed of themselves right now because they feel like they feel like there was a, a, a block to you this whole time. Like they was deliberately trying to stop you without even realizing they were trying to stop you. You are building and you ain't letting nobody get in the way of you building success, of you building your mind, your body, and your spirit. Point blank, period. And I'm going to close the message out right there. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ashe. Mwah.